in this video. Please enjoy. Here we go to the video. The Old Lady and Her Secret. Chapter 1. Sarah and Tina were two friends who lived in the neighborhood of a village. They loved exploring landscapes, riding their bicycles, admiring the beautiful scenery, drawing sketches, taking photographs, and painting as well. They had a passion for adventure, nature, and art. They always looked for new places to explore, capture them, and recreate the exquisite sceneries on their canvases. One day, they decided to explore the landscape next to the forest farther away from their home. They packed their bags with water, snacks, paints, pencils, brushes, sketchbooks, canvases, and cameras, and set off on their adventure journey. They followed a mud road leading to a vast field of wildflowers. They stopped at the magical attraction and took pictures and draw sketches. Then they continued their journey, enjoying the breeze, the soothing and musical chirping of birds, and the warm sunlight. They soon reached a forest where found a variety of attractive wildflowers that looked inviting and magical. They looked at each other, nodded, and entered the forest hoping to find some interesting scenery and musical sounds like the chirping of birds and the rippling noise of the streams and brooks. They rode along a narrow path that wound through tall and lowering trees, admiring the lush green meadows in between listening to the bird songs. They felt the magical ecstasy as they were in a fairy tale. However, they went deeper into the forest in a flow, and later they realized that it was a mistake. The path became more and more difficult to proceed, the overgrown bushes and vines making it hard to ride their bicycles. They turned back and tried to find the way back home, but failed due to the thick forest and the overgrown vines. They started to get panic and checked their phones, but there was no signal. They looked at the sky and found the sun was setting and felt sorry for their decision. It was growing dark, and they decided to stick together hoping to find a way out of the forest before it got too dark. They broke branches of plants, cut the vines, cleared a path, and pushed their bicycles through the clearing amidst the thorny plants. Although their arms and legs got scratched and hurt by the thorny plants, they did not give up their efforts. As it grew pitch dark, they looked around hoping to find some hope, and noticed a small light at a distance. It looked like a firefly. They moved towards the light. They felt relieved. In a hopeful and curious state of mind, they decided to move hoping to find someone who could help them or at least get a shelter for the night. They were tired due to the severe cold and endless efforts. They reached the source of light after a great struggle, and there they found a wooden hut which was roofed with grass. It looked very old and shabby. There was an old lady in the hut. She was sitting near a fireplace, brewing a pot of soup. Her hair was gray with wrinkled skin and bright eyes. To be continued. Thank you.